Hey, hey. Spring Lafay, Simple Tarot. Okay, um, this is a reading for the sign of Aquarius, and um, I'm going to take several different cards. I want to take a few of these. It's this one. <clears throat> for Aquarius. Can I have another? Thank you. Okay, we got three, and that's awesome. Then I want to take you some of the work your lot. Okay. okay. May I please have one more? Two. Okay. Okay. I want one of these. Two, hmm. Three, no, that's too many. I'm only feeling one spirit. May I have the one? The one? This, okay, there it is. Four Aquarius, okay. Okay. You want uh, some of these? Best for Aquarius. Too many. Too many. I'll take that one. May I have the other? May I have another one? Four Aquarius. Four Aquarius. Okay, it looks like we just got one. So, may I have one of these? Thank you. There's one of those. Now, I want to kind of get to it. First, I'm going to start here with Healer of Abundance. That's our angel message. And it says, Healer of Abundance. Never doubt that you can make a difference. Your creativity and ability to be innovative make you destined to succeed. It might be time to expand your career, but don't forget to leave time for family. This situation involves a person, possibly you, who's down to earth with a gift for design or decorating. He or she is open-minded and nurturing. Then we've got three of these. These are our uh, crystal oracle, oracle cards, excuse me, like angel oracles. We got sodalite, kyanite, and malachite. And it says for sodalite, socialize or join in. Make healthy and supportive new friends. And connections by getting involved with a group of like-minded people. And then we have Kyanite. Make time for self-care. Taking care of yourself is essential right now. And then we have Malachite Prosperity. There's a positive shift in your flow of divine support. So that's beautiful messages. Awesome. Then over here we have four of these that came out. We've got Sisterhood of the Rose, Beauty and Devotion, Priestess, Mystic, Teacher. So you may be a teacher or you're going to meet one. Um, you may be a mystic um, and you may know. It's like you just have a, this knowing um, or you'll meet somebody that has. The gate, Great, okay, The Great Gathering. It's all coming together, intuitive hits, and your soul tribe. Oh my goodness, this is beautiful. The initiation, rite of passage, crossing the threshold. Oh wow. Unbound, releasing soul patterns, contracts, and past lives. 
not going to be bound or held any longer. That's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Then we have Tiger Fire. I choose to be unstoppable. My passion is my power. I am bold. I am brave. Mighty force come to my aid. That is beautiful. Wow. Then we have number 64, which is Wasp Spirit. Sometimes life stings, and sometimes it does. But that doesn't mean we just give up. No. Let's take you some tarot. This is an angel deck for Aquarius. The special message, please, Spirit. What is the special message for the sign of Aquarius? What does Aquarius need to know? What does Aquarius need to know today? Okay. King of Air, brilliant, impartial, professional, and diplomatic. Spark your mind with confidence. Seek out professional advice, balance, mental and emotional considerations. So you need to seek some advice where it is involving, you know, your profession. If you are stumped about something, seek advice. We've got number six, which is the lover's card. Archangel Raphael. Intimate relationships. Carefully weigh your decisions. Good health. So take that in carefully. Don't jump into anything. Ten of air. The end of a difficult situation. Embrace the change and accept things to get better now. Expect things to get better now. Recovering from an addiction. So now, I'm going to go ahead and tell you, an addiction can even be to someone. You know, it can be to pain. It can be to, you know, an emotional addiction to someone who's hurt you. Um, or it can be an addiction to um, something, you know, it could be overeating, it can be drinking, it can be drugs, it can be um, hoarding. It can be so many different things. Overspending, porn, um, but it can also be to pain. And I feel like for someone it is. Tell me more. And it's not really that they're addic addicted to the pain. They don't want the pain, but they may be addicted to, to not letting go of it. It's like someone is holding them because they won't let go of it. You see what I'm saying? So it's kind of like an addiction. Four of air. Time to rest or take a vacation. Allow more time before making a decision. Meditation may provide answers. So take your time. You know, take your time. Don't rush into anything. Don't jump the gun. Four of fire contentment, peace, and abundance. A happy home life, a successful completion of a project. That's beautiful. So something coming together. That's awesome sauce. And then we have number nine, which is the hermit. Archangel Raziel. Spend time in quiet meditation spiritual teaching, self-discovery. And you get a lot of that you can from sleeping, actually. Um, you'd be amazed. And you need to pay attention to your dreams. They can speak to you. The angels speak to you through your dreams. Okay, you got six of earth, which is um, gifts of money, time, or effort. New career, opportunities, Receiving a loan or paying off debts. Awesome. Then we have Six of Fire. Victory. Good news is on its way. Public recognition or awards. Oh my goodness. Looking good. This is looking good. Um, stay on your path. You know, recognize if you have, like I said, gifts. Allow spirit to guide you. Keep you strong. Nine of air. Expecting the worst. Worst. Self-fulfilling prophecies. Sleepless nights. Okay, you need to be aware of that. You don't want to, to, 
expect the worst. You'll bring it in. You don't want any self-fulfilling prophecies. We need one more. We got two. You need to change that up. You need to move away from that. Oh, yeah, from that. Yeah, right here. Number seven, the chariot. Archangel Metatron. Move right on away from that right there. Uh, an important achievement, self-discipline, and willpower. Public recognition. You're about to get recognized for something, and you may not even realize it. Number 17, the star card. You know, that's the card of Aquarius. Um, beautiful card to get. That's wishes coming true. You know, that can be a healing card. Um, it's Archangel Johael, and it says, Happy times make positive, optimistic, long-term plans on the right path. So you're on the right path. Things looking good. Things going forward. This is a beautiful reading. Uh, it's It really is. It's uplifting, upbeated. Um, I really like it. So that's what I've got for you. I'm not feeling extended on this one. Um, and, you know, if you like the readings, please do give them a thumbs up and uh, subscribe. Tell your friends, you know, share out the readings. And I appreciate each and every one of you. Much light and love. Till next time. Bye.